With the start of the 49th session of the Human Rights Council and with the aim of calling for the release of political prisoners and prisoners of conscience in Bahrain, the Arab Gulf Center for Human Rights, in cooperation with Americans for Democracy and Human Rights, organized a joint symposium with other organizations such as the Bahrain Center for Human Rights and Amnesty International. The director of the center, Khalid Ibrahim, said that this event represents a unified call to demand the immediate release of those in prison solely for their legitimate and peaceful expression of their fundamental freedoms. He stressed that this is a chronic problem in repressive and Bahraini society and the prison that prisoners of conscience have spent more than a decade in harsh and inappropriate conditions. He asked the speakers to put forward what he could be done or what could be done to secure the release of political prisoners and human rights defenders. Human rights first rights activist Brian, Brian Dooley said, I, have, I am very pleased that after 11 years of the uprising, there is still interest in human rights in Bahrain, especially among the Bahraini diaspora. diaspora. He condemned the efforts of the Bahrain Institute for Rights and Democracy, BIRD, and similar organizations to keep Bahrain on the global political agenda to demand the release of political prisoners and prisoners of conscience.